Hi everyone, how are you? It is Dr. Emily, functional podiatrist, human movement specialist, founder of EBFA Global and Naboso. So we are going to be speaking about stiffness as stability. Now, oftentimes when people hear the, hear the word stiffness, they think more so of, oh, my lower back is stiff. Oh, my, my leg is stiff, my hip is stiff. Kind of that association of what happens after we sit for a period or we wake up in the morning. Now, the way that I actually want you to think about stiffness is going to be something that is referencing your fascia. So fascial tension or fascial stiffness is going to be a sign of stabilization. Now, fascia, if you're familiar with the term tensegrity or integrated tension, is part of how we resist gravity. So by engaging and using our muscles, it creates a fascial response, and that fascial response is stiffness or tension. So let's experience it for ourselves. As you're standing there, or maybe even if you're sitting there, I want you to engage your TVA. So I'm gonna engage my TVA and lift my pelvic floor. As I do this, muscle contraction, isometric muscle contraction, I feel the sensation I feel or the response is going to be tension, stiffness in my fascia. So every muscle group, muscle fiber, muscle fibril, fascicle, everything is surrounded by fascia and connective tissue, which means all muscle contractions have an influence or response in your fascia. And again, that fascial response is going to be tension or stiffness. Let's take another example. If your arms are out to the side and you're reaching, 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 like you want to touch the walls and someone is trying to pull your arms out what you're doing is a isometric contraction. What I feel in my body is tension. If I stand nice and strong and I push my toes into the floor and do short foot, what do I feel in my feet? Tension, stiffness. So what I am doing in each of these exercises, such as engaging the TBA, pushing my toes, toes down into the floor, reaching my arms out nice and long, or even making a fist, is I am engaging tension stiffness. Now, tension stiffness equals stability through the mechanism of what is called tension stacking. Tension stacking, and we have different tension zones in our body. We go through this in the BTS level one through EBFA Global. These different zones are going to be our core, our feet, our shoulders, and our hand. Technically, you could also say the palate as well. And when we engage them, they stack and they sequence with each other. So as I stand here and I engage my TVA, I feel a certain level of tension or stiffness. If I hold that position and push my toes into the floor, boom, I just felt my tension and stiffness go higher. If I open my arms nice and wide and I reach to the outer walls, I felt my tension and stiffness go higher. If I bring my tongue to my palate while pushing the toes, engaging TVA, reaching to the outer walls and then pushing my tongue to the palate, I just stepped even more. So that's how I want you to think about the term stiffness. Stiffness is a moment in time, this transient stabilization through our fascial integration through a response to your muscle contractions is fascial tension or fascial stiffness. We use that as a mechanism of stability. So if I was doing a squat and I'm coming down in my squat as I push and I move that resistance, that force, I am engaging my toes. I'm lifting my levator ani. I'm gonna grab the bar a little bit harder with, with my fist and I'm gonna exhale as I push up. The fact that I stacked those three different areas increases my overall stiffness, which increases my overall stability, and therefore I am stronger. Yes, we are only as strong as we are stable, and we're only as stable as we are integratedly tensioned or stiff. Now, the last layer that I want to add to this has to do with 
sensory. So by bringing in sensory stimulation, so right now you can't see it, but I'm barefoot on the Naboso flooring. So by me, me being in this access point of the skin and the bottom of my feet, I am activating even more of my intrinsic muscles. So I'm gonna get a higher level of foot stiffness. In my hand, I have something new from Naboso. It is with our texture. I'm here. I have the Neural on this side if I want to use this product, but I'm incorporating something with my hands. So I'm bringing in not just something for me to squeeze my hand around to create stiffness, which it does, but I'm bringing in tactile sensory to get even higher upregulation into the brain. So when you think tension stacking, stiffness, stability, isometrics, and performance or injury prevention. I want you to be thinking about sensory stimulation as well. <coughs> if you want to learn more about how you can incorporate tension, stacking, and stiffness, head to ebfaglobal.com to check out some of these cool sensory products. Head to naboso.com. Stay barefoot strong.